we wanted to see today how Maja reacts to a robotic hoover. Um, so we've been given this one. And yeah, I'm going to get it going, bring him down and then see what he does. Because he'll either ignore it like he does with other things or he will chase after it, which I really hope will be a lot more fun. <laughs> Let's get it going. And I will give him a shout down in a second once it's going. And then we shall see what he does. You're not sure about it. You're not running away. Trying to find its way home, Mage. You're not sure. It's home. What? It's I'm gonna try and make him less scared. Mitch? So long it takes him to notice. What's up? No? There's one on there, Mage. What's this? So I don't think I want to touch that Hoover. Now, should we try a few more? At least you know it's not going to hurt you now. Major, Mitch? what's this? Major! Sean, you've not got me. Mitch, what's this? Major. Look, here. What's this? <laughs> Good boy. It's not scary. At age, that's not what you're meant to do with the hoover. What do you reckon then? It's hiding from you. Oh, it's coming to get you, mage. Mage is trying to find its way home and I think you're in the way. That mage starts saying excuse me. Watch that fluffy tail. It's coming for you, Mage. I think you're in its way. I think it's saying excuse me. Do you not care? It might hoover up your tail. Do you not care? You're going to put your tail on top of it instead. I'm not sure that's going to help. So one thing you can't really see with our carpet, which is just look, is this is what happens literally daily. Um, I've not long brushed Major. Um, we hoovered yesterday with a really strong hoover. And then this happens. <laughs> so this is literally why we need something like a little robotic hoover, just so it does every night a little clean, gets rid of all this, any bigger bits. And yeah, this is perfect for it. Well, oh, it's officially been majored. Let's have a look at the remote. So one really cool thing is that it comes with this remote. So obviously you've got the time on it. Um, this takes it back to its charging dock. Um, so that's how it knows to charge itself. So when it's running out of battery, it'll automatically do that. Which is really cool because it saves us having to sort that out. 
Um, this is just the one that we put it on mainly for it to just go around the room and clean. Mitch. <laughs> um, we've got clock settings and the destination so we can make it go whichever way we want it to go if we've got somewhere in particular. And this one's the time set up. We've got the schedule, so this one we're going to use during the night. So we're going to set it at like 2am to do a clean every night and then Major's Fur should be easier to stay on top of, hopefully. Uh, this one's spot cleaning, so if we've got a particular area, it will focus on it. This one does the edge of the room, so we're going to set up our room and it'll do all around the edges specifically rather than in the middle. This is just if it's a one room clean. Um, because it can go into different ones and these are the different power levels so we can obviously set it to sort of low medium and high so yeah that's really cool that it comes with all that um, and we can just sit there and do that while we're watching tv then the other cool thing is it's got this mop attachment for the kitchen so it holds the water so if we want it to mop rather than us doing it you can just obviously you slot that in it goes into the hooper and then it mops with this so it's a really cool way. And then they've given us, which automatically comes in the box, the spare heads so you can see. Those are the things that clean. They sort of ruffle up the dirt. Spare mop head and other spare bits. So that's really cool. So this is the underside. As you can see, it's got all the information on it. But this is how you empty it. So you just pull it out. And then, I can't do it one-handed. Um, but if you open it up and then yeah it's got the little filter and then all the stuff it's picking up so yeah it's fab the other cool thing is it comes with this app so you can see it's battery it will actually map the area it's sort of hoovering around here um, it tells you what the settings on um, Simon's called it Jeeves <laughs> um, and then yeah you've got remote control so if you want to use that rather than the actual remote control and then all the different settings that the control has so yeah that's um, a really helpful way to connect it to your phone um, and set the timer on your phone if you don't want to do it through the app so if you've got Alexa you can then connect through the app and through the Alexa app and then set everything going by Alexa so then you just voice command the whole thing and it will do all that for you too so that was our quick review of the Yultenic D5S Pro Robotic Vacuum Cleaner. Um, and we actually think it's great, I really think it's picked up a lot of things and we're going to use it, like I said, probably every night. Um, just to help keep on top of Major Sphere because it does get everywhere. And this is going to be a really quick and easy time saving way just to set it off and go put it on its timer. So yeah, we, um, we really think this is worth it. Mm -hmm.